This quick start video will show you how to analyze your measurement. You will need your OTARC and the OT software application. So you have recorded your first measurement. Now you can make some selections based on how you want to view your recording. The same applies if you want to analyze a part of the measurement while the recording is still ongoing. To show the whole recording, press these arrows. Or right click on the graph and choose Fit Width. To have auto scaling on the y axis, press these arrows. Or right click on the graph and choose Fit Height. Note that when you click in the graph, you will see that the scrolling stops, but the recording still continues in the background if you have an ongoing measurement. Zoom in the x direction with your mouse wheel. Just like that. When you want to zoom in the y direction, do the same thing but hold the Alt key on your computer or the Option key on your Mac. When you want to zoom into a larger part of the graph, select the Zoom button and mark the area you want to investigate. Select Drag to move along the recording and to see the latest points of your measurement. Or follow the graph by clicking on the arrow button. In the top right corner, you can find the statistics section. It shows the minimum, average, and maximum values for the complete measurement. If you have selected any part of the graph, the values shown are for that selection. If you have recorded multiple measurements, click on the arrow for the drop down menu. As you can see here, you can have several recordings in the same project. They are easily renamed to keep track of what was done. Do a right click on the recording name to change it. If you want to sync the two recordings for an easier comparison, you can shift one of them in time by clicking on the small arrow next to the recording name. You'll see an offset field to enter the offset length. You can also mark the distance between the recordings, do a right click on one of the recordings and choose offset left or right. As always, if you have more questions about this, check out the Coitec documentation.